All right, y'all. So I have a, another food tour booked at around six. It is currently 5 p.m. and this traffic looks pretty crazy. So I'm about to head out. Hopefully it stops raining and I can show you guys some more awesome food from Bangkok. guys we made it to Chinatown and it just stopped raining right as we came here and we're gonna eat at this restaurant this is my tour guide Kevin Mon say hello. hello and we're gonna have some food here she already ordered for us and it's gonna be spicy so let's see if it was as good as the last one because Wow, that looks so good, guys. So, what are we eating? Uh, and I will show you here. This is a, this is a rice noodle. They deep fry the rice noodle. And then deep they, fried rice noodle. Yeah, and this, they put the egg on the top. Yeah. Oh. With the gravy. Yeah. With the gravy. Mm. Guys, you yeah, you can't smell this, but it smells so good. Oh. We got another one. And what is this one? And you see the noodles here? This is a green bean, green bean noodle. Green bean noodle. Yes. Okay, I never green tried bean. a green bean noodle before. And this is a bit uh, spicy. You know how we like spicy food here. Let's go. Okay, let's try this. The noodles very good. Yeah. Wow. Mm. And I like the uh, the gravy. Yeah. The gravy is so good too. Wow. That's so good guys. Alright guys, I just tried <clears throat> the green bean noodles and <coughs> they are a little spicy. Like this one got me. I'm not gonna lie. It is so yummy. It has some squid, it's got shrimp, it's got octopus. It's, it's just so good. There's just so much good stuff here. So we're gonna have some pomegranate juice and this looks so good. Oh my god, no sugar. This is so good. Mm. This place is so packed. They have grilled squid here and it looks amazing. And just by the look of that line, it must taste the same. I don't know if we're gonna have food here, but wow, it smells delicious. Oh, look at the size of these monsters. Look at that.
this brave. What? <laughs> they got them all. I'm convinced we're gonna try some of these uh, nutritious bugs. So let's go for it. We got grasshopper. So just eat the whole thing? Yeah, the whole thing. The whole thing. Grasshopper. Wait a minute. That's good. Yeah, you do not think that you're eating a bug. It's like a chip. Okay. Like a peanut. Like a peanut, but with the legs. Mmm. -hmm. Mm, wow. Like a peanut with legs. Who knew? <laughs> All right. Next, we got the bamboo worm, and from what we just learned, this is the most expensive one. It's about 700 baht per kilo because you can't farm it. You have to actually find it. So here we go. Okay. Good. A little nutty. Mm, nutty. No legs. <laughs> and no legs. Wow. Okay, that's two for two. I wasn't expecting to like the bugs. Okay, let's try number three. Number three is a silkworm. This guy looks like the one from the Lion King. Is look at this thing. Look at it. Okay. Oh. Okay. Ready? No, I'm kidding. It's so good. Mmm. Okay. Wow. I didn't think I was gonna like the bugs. Very good choice. Wow, that was amazing. Thank you. Guys, we're gonna try the crispy pancake. And these guys are made with coconut and some salt and pepper on the orange one. And this yellow one is an egg yolk, usually duck egg. So it's like a little crispy taco. So let's try the, the little tacos. Very crispy. Okay, so how do you eat it? Let me see how you do it. And have. Mmm. This is so good. Little coconutty, crispy. The little egg is sweet in it. It's got a little bit of a kick with the pepper. Wow. Really, really good. Good job. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. All right, and then we got the second crispy taco, and this is the one with the coconut. So let's try this. New favorite. <laughs> wow. Mm. Wow, this is so good. I want to learn how to make this so I can show you guys, but this is amazing. What is the dough made from? The wheat, uh, flour? wheat flour. Wow, and the, the little white part? The white part is made of the uh, white egg. Oh, it's like the, the, the egg of the, the egg of the white of the egg. Yeah. Wow, that this is so good with the coconut guys. Like you got to come to try this in Bangkok. They're so so good. Aroy. Mm. 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 
They are winning. Like they have a line. Like, and we just get that line straight to the front. We're just gonna have some of this crispy pork. They also have uh, the innards of the pig. So they have stomach, uh, long heart. I don't know. I already tried the bugs, but you know, when in Bangkok, gotta try everything. All right, guys. This is the Michelin star winning dish. I have it with crispy pork. Look at that, that looks so good. And then over here, we have it with the innards of the pig. That looks so tasty. Let's try this. All right, so let's try the soup first. Oh my God. Three for three, this is so good. Mmm, peppery. Mmm. Is it like a, what kind of broth is it? Is it like a pork? Pork broth with, oh my god, this is delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Let's try the crispy pork. Wow. Wow. So good. Desserts every Michelin star it has. Insane. It's loud, it's, it's busy, but it just makes sense. Bangkok is just an amazing city. You guys have to come and try this food over here. Oh my god. I can't have enough of this. Mm. Mini green dumpling. Mini green dumpling. Okay. With the coconut uh, milk. Okay. And the green dumpling is made of the rice rice flour and the green bean flour. Rice and flour and green bean flour. And tapioca. And they the, they they put in the coconut milk and the the coconut milk they mix with the palm sugar. With palm sugar. Okay, let's try it. Oh. Alright guys, I would have never gotten this if it wasn't for my host. Like this is amazing. It has palm sugar and the little green guys, they're like little mini dumplings made of green bean flour and tapioca flour. It's delicious. Mm. Alright guys, we're finishing up our food tour. Everyone, you have been amazing. Thank you so much. All the food was great. And now we're finishing up in a tuk-tuk ride right through Chinatown. This is so beautiful. Thank you so much.
guys uh, today was such an eventful day it was amazing I finished the tour at the flower market all the flowers are being delivered from the farms up north and I got this beautiful lotus flowers from my host uh, she taught me so much about Thai culture and Buddhist culture the meaning of the lotus flower to them and I couldn't be happier so I'm ready to call it a night and please tune in for the next episode bye